This one's for buy to let HMO investors looking to get commercial valuation rather than bricks and mortars. In my opinion, um, you need to really have a larger HMO, maybe six bedroom, well, I would say seven bedrooms or more. Uh, and then there are a number of lenders that will look at commercial valuations, which is treating the property as a commercial business rather than a normal property. Generally, the way they will look at it is can that property act as a commercial entity and not be quickly changed back into a residential unit. So there is a differentiator. Um, generally, a lot of the commercially minded lenders tend to look at the commercial valuations. But I would say, you know, if you've got a normal semi-detached and it's been converted into five or six bedrooms, in my opinion, um, I think you're probably gonna stick with the bricks and mortars. A lot of them will consider it. If it's seven or more, then you'll start looking at lenders that could potentially look at commercial valuations for HMOs.